We turn to Manatee County this morning. Heavy rains last night causing major headaches. Look at this for people there. Flooding waters rising as the rain came pouring down. Amanda Shavari live in Manatee County this morning. And Amanda, um, give us an idea of what it's like down there right now. Well, Paul, this neighborhood roadway completely taken over by water. Where I'm standing right now, the water comes up to about my ankles. But from what we can see, the water actually gets deeper as this road continues down. Down there, there's actually a car stuck from this water. Let's give you a look at what this road looked like just a few hours ago. We are standing at Fifth Street Court East in Bradenton mailboxes on this street. They look like they're in the middle of ponds rather than lining the roadway. And you can see one of the photojournalists at News Channel 8 walking through the flooded street water up to his ankles and shins and best lives nearby her street so came up to her garden beds and so high it came up to the middle of her car tire which was parked in her driveway loud thunderstorms and you could just hear the it just downpours like you couldn't even hear the tv it was coming down so hard Best is now waiting for that water to dry and the sun to come up so she can see if this flooding caused any damage. The good news for Best as we come back out and join you live, none of this flooding actually came into her home, but she says she fears her neighbors aren't that lucky, Paul. And, and you know what, one thing that we didn't touch upon, I think it's really important here, Amanda, you know, was anyone injured in any of this? At least, uh, do you know that this morning? Well, at, at this hour, what we know about this area we're standing in right, right now is that no one on this roadway was injured last night, so that's very good, Paul. But again, as people wake up, they're really going to have to assess any damage that was done to their homes because we do know that some of this water is likely in basements or in living rooms of these people's homes. The insurance adjusters will no doubt be there today. Amanda Shavari, live in Manatee County for us. Thank you so much.